morning from Ibiza guys. We landed really late last night. So literally we got in, checked into the hotel, went to bed and that was us done. So we've just got up and we're about to go and get some breakfast now. But I thought before we go and do that, I would just really quickly show you around the room. This hotel is just so nice. It's just like really earthy and minimally and just a bit of me. So let me show you the room. So we have our little balcony here and then in the room, then there's obviously the bed. And then over here, we've got like a little sink area that's got these mirrors. <laughs> I always do that, I need to stop. There's got these little mirrors. There's also another big mirror here. Then we've just got our robes. The shower is in here, which is like a really nice, big rainfall shower. And then in that door is just the toilet. And then just at the beginning of the room, these are like two really big wardrobes for us to put our stuff in. But yeah, so we are just gonna go out now and get some breakfast. And then I don't really know what the plan is for the rest of the day or even for the rest of the whole time we're here. I just thought I would just show you guys what we get up to, like what food we eat, what good spots we find, just basically a bit of an Ibiza vlog. Let's go and get some breakfast. <laughs> I can tell that Kenny thinks that he's on holiday. It's like 11 a.m., not even. Hello. <laughs> and this is what he's ordered with breakfast. I've got like a green detox juice. Obviously picked up the holiday essentials while we're out. Is it really a European holiday if you haven't bought crisps to the hotel room? The view is so pretty here. It's lunchtime, I'm literally just gonna have this little avocado again shop, quinoa salad. And this is what Kenny's having. I think it's sea bass with some kind of like veggies. Us doing anything where you don't have a pink drink. Part of the vlog, isn't it? Having a nice time. Look how pretty it is, guys. So we're just having dinner now, it's like tapas, so it'll be loads of different courses. But this is some kind of black bean and sauerkraut salad, and then Kenny's had, what are they, sardines? Yeah, Anchovies. Calamari, patron peppers, chickpea and aubergine tagine, and vegan tatas brothers. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. So we've literally just finished dinner. Oh, I'm so full. We ate that so incredibly quickly. I can't get my mask off. Um, but we're just gonna go home now and literally collapse into bed because we barely slept last night. We got here so late. <laughs> so that is enough attention seeker. But yeah, honestly, it feels like it's been the longest 24 hours. We only landed, in fact, it's been less than 24 hours since we landed last night. So we are completely exhausted. We're just gonna go home, collapse into bed and I will pick up with you guys in the morning. I just thought while it's empty, I'd quickly show you the gym. It's like the prettiest gym you've ever seen. So here's all like the cardio treadmill machines. They're all made out of this like really nice wood. Then you've got rowing machines, bikes, little bench, um, kettlebells. These are like the free weights. 
There are these really cool little bags. And then this is like your cables. But yeah, how pretty is it? So we're back at the same place we came to yesterday because where we were going to go was closed and this place was really good. So again, I've got green juice and Kenny's got like an acai. Is that how you say it? Acai smoothie thing. So today I've had what Kenny had yesterday, which are these sweet corn fritters because they were literally so good when I tried his yesterday. And what's this? Eggs Benedict. I'm just currently sat doing some editing of the workout video that I'm about to upload this weekend. But this is my editing spot today. I can think of worse places to edit, although I would rather be over there where Kenny is lying in the sun. Thank you. Thank you. For lunch, guys, we just ordered. This is some um, vegan truffle, asparagus, and mushroom sushi. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And then this is a tofu and what? Tofu and quinoa salad. And then Kenny's got, what did you get? Salmon avocado. Salmon avocado. Looks really, really good. And this is our view. Hey guys, I've honestly spent most of the day editing. Anything that I've done other than edit, you've honestly seen, so that gives you an idea of my day. Now I've just done like literally three minute makeup, thrown on a suit. It's the same suit I always wear, but in a different color shock and now we're just going to go and grab some dinner just before the sun goes down so obviously i'll take you guys with us i don't actually know where we're going hopefully kenny has got that planned but yeah the rest of the weekend and the rest of the trip is a lot more action-packed let's go and get some dinner because i am hungry excuse any mess that you're about to see in the background or on the desk here but this is what i'm wearing it's literally the exact same suit that i have and always wear in cream um but in blue from zara and i love it of course guys i want to show you kenny's outfit because i think it looks really good so these are the ones we got these together from cos then he's you can't actually see he's got cool little trainers on so where's your t-shirt from <laughs> helmet helmet lang i can't oh it's such a sunny nice evening Guys, I don't even think I've shown you. I can't actually remember if maybe I showed you on the first night, but this is our like little Fiat 500. Like it's the smallest car ever compared to our car at home, but we're like actually obsessed with it. Kenny's embarrassed because we're vlogging in front of other people. I told him I don't care, but look at his face. Um, so this is where we're gonna have dinner. It's behind us. It's literally so pretty and the view is so nice. So we're just having a beer and a glass of red wine. Obviously, the wine is mine and the beer is Kenny's. Actually, that's not obvious at all these days. Kenny's got some sardines, and then we've got some pita and hummus to share, just to start with. So we have some kind of bruschetta type thing, not quite, but nearly. Some broccoli and cauliflower with garlic. This is crispy monkfish for Kenny, some kind of cannelloni, cannellini, don't know how you say, pasta for Kenny, and some potatoes, of course. I'm just going to take my makeup off now, and then we're going to go to sleep, so I will speak to you guys in the morning. We're moving hotels in the morning, actually, so we'll have a new hotel to show you. And I don't know, Kenny's made plans for the day while I've been working, so I'll speak to you guys in the morning. This is our hotel from the outside. Um, it's called Sir Joan or something. Sir Joan, Sir. This. I'm not going to attempt to pronounce it. It's really nice and it's right in Ibiza town. And then we've just got this whole area. This is the bed, which by the way, we just lay on and it's the comfiest bed you've ever seen. Then out here we have this little balcony and then it looks over the pool area down there, which is really cool. And then there's this whole wall which is all like like the toilets in here, the showers in that mirrored one. This is a huge like area for luggage, which is really cool. And then just like a little bathroom area here. If you can hear all of that noise, there's like some protest going on today. some lunch 
brunch at a place, this place. Again, I won't bother to pronounce it, um, but it's so pretty. And then we're literally right next door to Blue Marlin, which is what all of that is. But in here, it's so nice too. Kenny's ordered a two-person seafood player, so. Sweat now. You can't just see me, sign. Look at all of that. It's such a nice day. I literally cannot wait to get down to the beach down there. We've just come to the beach just to chill for the afternoon, and it's quite busy, but it's really cute. Look how beautiful it is here, guys. I'm wearing a really weird outfit of the blazer that I seem to wear every single day and like a bikini underneath it. Which by the way is a Renner, which is one of my best friends um, swimwear lines. And it's like totally sustainable and just the most gorgeous, gorgeous company. So I will link a Renner down below. Anyway, we went back to the hotel after the beach, did some work and then got changed and now we're just heading out for dinner. Right in the middle of Ibiza town, there's actually a vegan restaurant, which we saw yesterday. So I thought it's only right to at least try it once. It actually looks really good. It's just here, everyone's outside. Where we had dinner last night is like over there somewhere. We've just got a glass of wine and a beer and we're waiting for our food to come. So we've just got this as a starter. I think it's like red pepper hummus. Kind of thing. So for our mains, we got wok fried greens with noodles and underneath this pile of obviously vegan cheese. We have mushroom risotto. We're just gonna share both, but they look really good. It looks like he's pausing. Morning guys, please don't judge my hair. It is still got all the seawater from yesterday. In. But today we're doing like a boat day, so I couldn't really touch my hair because that would be stupid to be in the suit all day. So we're just getting breakfast now near the hotel at a place called Pet Passion. And then we are getting ferry across to Foreman Terra. That's how you say it. So breakfast is here. It is avocado and kimchi on some kind of like olive sourdough. It's really, really good. And then Kenny got, these are like homemade hash browns at the bottom, avocado, and then obviously egg. And then this is some kind of detox juice with like ginger, cucumber, spinach, and all that stuff. We've just picked up our little boat and we're gonna go and have a bit of an explore. Um, the guy told us there's a couple of places that you can only reach by boats on this island. So we're gonna go and check them out. So we've just got back from our boat trip and I told Kenny to put sun cream on all day and look at the result. Good if you're face. on the tan, that's what you have to do. No, it's not. And that's not responsible advice to put on the internet. Look at the colour of that face. This is what not to do, kids. This is where we wear sun cream, like me. Hey guys, so we are obviously home from the boat trip and we just went back to the hotel, got changed, got dressed for dinner. I'm actually wearing this like kind of sparkly dress tonight. So it's pretty dressy for me. Um, and now we're going for dinner at Amante. It's actually our last night in Ibiza tonight, which I don't think I have said because tomorrow we fly to Portugal. Kenny, do you want to do a little outfit of the evening, darling? You seem to be partial to these. The color on Kenny is outrageous. He's so tanned. Where's your top from, Cos? Everything is always from Cos. Cos? Cos and these. 
Samu Samu. Samu Samu and trainers, what are you wearing tonight? Easy. It's a lovely little whip here. Yeah, we've honestly loved this car. Would 100% say if you come to Ibiza and you haven't been before, which I'm pretty sure it's like literally only me in the whole world that hasn't been to Ibiza before, you need a car for sure. Because like all of the cool stuff we've done, you have to drive and it's so annoying getting taxis like all the time. And it's just so easy getting these. I don't think, how much did it cost to hire this? Do you, do you remember? Kenny said it was like 35, 40 pounds a day to hire the car, but I mean, you definitely spend that on taxi. We well, spend a lot more on taxis, so. It's worth doing. Anyway, I think where we're going for dinner is meant to be really, really pretty, so I will show you guys when we get there. Not bad for a dinner setting, is it, guys? Dinner, guys, but look how beautiful it is here. It's like honestly stunning. Good morning, guys. So, obviously, last night I told you that it was our last night in Ibiza last night, and we are flying to Portugal today. Well, Portugal have just put UK, like people from the UK on some kind of like red list of their own where we have to quarantine for 14 days if we go there. So we have just spent the entire morning cancelling everything in Portugal, Portugal, trying to get our money back for all of that. And now we are due to check out of this hotel basically right now. And we have no idea what the plan is now for the rest of the day. So we're basically going to just check out of here. We've still got the car, so we're going to go get some breakfast and try and figure out a plan. I don't know whether we're going to stay in Ibiza, go home, go somewhere else that's on the green list. No idea. But yeah, obviously I will keep you updated and let you know what happens. But that has been how our morning has gone this morning. We've come back to the same place as we came to yesterday because it was so good. But this morning I've had tofu scramble, which has got like green peppers and red onion in. And then side of avo. And then this is like olive bread. It's honestly delicious. And then today I got a side of a hash brown because Kenny had them yesterday. He's had the same thing. And honestly, it was so good. But yeah, Kenny's just currently all the way over there on the phone to the airline, trying to get a refund for that. This morning's been a whole load of admin. Hey guys, it's been a very, very, very long day and a long time since I updated you on our situation. So obviously, as I told you this morning, we couldn't fly to Portugal, which was the original plan today. We've ended up just checking back into the first hotel we were in, the Oku, because um, we loved it here. And we've just got a couple of nights here, and then we're gonna kind of see, like, is there anywhere else to go? Should we just stay here? Should we go home? Like, I don't know, we're just rolling with it now. We've got a new room and it's really nice. It's got like a really big balcony this time. It's a little bit different. We've just made a mess of it getting ready to go to dinner, so I'll show you that in the morning. But yeah, so we're happy now. We checked in here, we sat by the pool for like two hours, got the evening sun had a beer we've got a new rental car like all as well we're about to go and get some dinner now and it's at this place that's apparently really good for like vegan food which is exciting um it's kind of up in the hills in the middle of nowhere so i think it'll be really really pretty i'm wearing color tonight which is extremely rare for me and i don't know how to feel about it but i'll show you guys so i have this little like silk top that like a standard zara thing and then these i'll show you full length inside so this is my outfit on. You're definitely not meant to tie this here, but we're going with that. And then these are these like blue. They're kind of like, you know, the suits I always wear. They're kind of like the same material, but they're in this blue. And then I like, I'm obviously just going to wear flats tonight. Look how useful our drive to dinner is tonight. How beautiful. The trees look like orange from the sunset. Beautiful. Now Look at the colour on Kenny, he is so tanned. And then this is where we're having dinner. We're a little bit early, but hopefully that'll let us have a drink. How beautiful. 
I'm starting to think that Kenny does this on purpose because once again I've got a glass of bread and he's ordered a bright pink drink every time. Is it good? What is it? Is this, can this be made vegan? This one. Bigger? We've ordered so much food here, the waiter guy was like, I think that's too much food, but here we go. Um, so, to begin with, we've got Padron Pepe, and then we've got hummus and these, and then he's going to bring some bread. We definitely don't need the bread. We probably should have said don't bring the bread. Anyway, here we are. Uh, we got the bread, so we're going to be very, <laughs> very full. So guys, these are our mains. Obviously, Kenny's eating the fish, but we've he's got sea bass, octopus. I'm going to eat some of the veggies that it comes with. And then we've got this huge salad here, which is like pumpkin and kale and tomatoes and loads of yummy stuff. But yeah, it looks really good. Dinner was really good, guys. Kenny's very full. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning guys, we are about to head down and get some breakfast. Look how pretty our balcony is. We have like a really long balcony in this room. And then we have this like little seating area here. It's very pretty. Some kind of like photo shoot going on at the pool today. I think it might be finished now. We haven't had breakfast at the hotel yet just because we wanted to go and like try some other places. So this morning we're having breakfast at the hotel and I'm very excited because let's be honest, what is better than a hotel breakfast? This is the beach that we're going down to. It's a bit of a walk. We've got to walk all the way along here and then down to like that little cove over there. But for that reason, there's hardly anybody there. So it's so pretty. It really is so beautiful here. Like it's definitely worth the walk if you can. We just went for a swim. This like little beach that you can only get to by swimming. So I couldn't take you guys with us, but it's so, the water is so blue, it's so beautiful. Do you want to tell anyone about your moat? So Kenny's built a moat that he's really proud of and wants me to tell you about to stop the water from getting into his well. I don't know if that's foolproof, but I'll take it. Innovation. There's like a couple of people here now, but still, honestly, it's like 10 of us. So guys, we've just come for some lunch at this really cute little town. It's kind of right in the middle of the island, so it's a bit quieter, but it's really pretty. Yes. So guys, for lunch, we're just going to share a salad. Um, it is, it's got avocado, it's got walnut, it's got, this is tempeh, I think this is this macadamia cheese. Um, not sure what this is, some kind of tomato relish. It looks really, really good. Hey guys, I think I last spoke to you at lunchtime. I can't really remember, um, but I think so. And all we've done since then is go back to the hotel, chill by the pool for a bit, and then get ready for dinner, which is where we're on our way to now. We're going to a place called Bam Buddha, which neither of us have ever been to before. And loads of people actually, when I asked for recommendations for Ibiza, loads of people said Bam Buddha. So I'm excited, hopefully it's good. I am wearing this thing that I am absolutely obsessed with. <laughs> Guys, this is where our table is. But then look who we got with our table. <laughs> just this guy having a sleep. Luckily we're dog people. I just got like a gin cucumber cocktail to start and Kenny, not pink tonight babe, what is it? It's passion. 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 This is tofu and I can't remember everything else that's in there. It's vegan obviously, it looks really good with aubergine on the outside. This is crispy spring rolls and this is like a vegan pot thai. I ordered some chocolate ice cream, vegan obviously. Um, best decision I've ever made. Hey guys, we've got a big update. We are now in Palma. 
So we decided yesterday, I think, just to fly over. Kenny's getting ready here, making a lot of noise, and he's probably naked. Um, but we decided yesterday to fly over today just to spend a few nights here. We don't really have a plan. We've checked into, what's it called? I'll put the hotel somewhere here. So far, the service has been like literally 10 out of 10 and it's such a beautiful hotel. So would already highly recommend. Um, but anyway, we it's actually quite late now. We've just been like sorting stuff out. We chilled by the pool back in Ibiza for most of this morning. And then got our flight, blah, blah. You know, these things just take forever, don't they? We're gonna go up to the rooftop, just have a drink. And then we're gonna head out and try and find somewhere for dinner. When I was in Bashka the other day, just picking up the outfit I showed you that I wore last night. This was in there and it was in the sale and it was like 12 euros. And I think it's so nice. It's like really, really stretchy, really thin straps. It's basically backless with like a crisscross detailing. So yeah, really happy with that. This is, the room. This hotel's really funny, but this is literally the only room they have, Kenny said. And then we have actually like a really cute little balcony out here. It's only like a little one, but just to sit and have like morning cup of tea, morning coffee, and you can see the sea down there. So it's really cute. All the streets here are so pretty as well. So obviously tomorrow I'll show you around properly. Cheers. Cheers. So another Beautiful. Sunset. This is the view from our hotel rooftop pool bar area. So nice. Sunset. And then there's like a little pool. I'm just chilling, having a drink on the rooftop. There's a guy playing live music. Oh, no. He's actually quite happy, guys. I had a DM saying he's always miserable. He kind of is. <laughs> We're just walking to dinner. Look how pretty it is. I don't know if you guys have been to Palma, but I've been once before, and like this is what I remember of it like all the streets being so pretty, minus the car. Really good reviews, and that's an absolute bit of me. Quadron peppers, standard, and then this is Patatas Brothers for like a vegan version. And then Kenny and I have both got another glass of wine, so I'm probably gonna be drunk because I honestly don't drink. Hola. We're not too sure what this is, but it's vegan and it looks so good. Any good? Nice. Guys, I literally, I don't know what this is. This like really served type. It's not a pizza at all, but whatever it is. This food, unbelievable. Like number one, you have to come to Parma. We've both been before, could not recommend it enough. And this place, Bar Espana, so good, you have to come. Penny's got some octopus. Yeah. I wanted to drink way too much wine. My eyes are probably half closed. Can you still go? Hola. And now we must go, yeah. And now we might go 10 minutes and get a vegan ice cream. We just have our water and our juice here, and then this is the view. Honestly, so beautiful. And then over here, you've got the view of the old town. So nice. Kenny will be happy, you've got all your pastries. They've just bought over some avocado and some tomatoes for me, I'm just gonna have it on some toast. Look at this cool little teapot and tea situation. So guys, we're dressed and we're just going for a little walk now. I need to pop into Zara because a dress I bought in Ibiza has got like pools in it. So I'm just gonna pop into Zara and hopefully exchange that, really hoping to have it. And then we're just gonna have an explore really, maybe stop for some lunch at some point. So I'll show you a bit more of the city this morning. Now it's the daytime, it's so beautiful. Um, and just show you what we get up to. streets and all the doorways so beautiful guys I can't cope so pretty <laughs> Thank you. 
stopped for some lunch. We're just gonna have some kind of tapas, just something really light. And we are at this tapas place called Ombu, and it's like, I'll show you. So this is the place. And then, you know, I showed you earlier this view. It's so nice. Having a beer, because I'm a newfound beer drinker, as you guys know. Yum, crispy tomato bread. This is some kind of aubergine mushroom dish. It looks really, really yummy. so we just spent the rest of the afternoon like wandering around and then we lay by the pool for a bit and just kind of relaxed and now I'm ready for dinner and we're gonna go to this place it's like kind of a similar vibe to last night more of like well it kind of looks like more locals would go there than like a touristy flashy type of place because last night was really really good so it's another tapas place and then we've got a bar booked that I went to with my friend before when I was here many years ago and that bar is like the bar is so so nice so obviously i'll take you guys with me there i'm just standing on the balcony now and honestly look how pretty it is like just between the houses you can see the sea and the sun setting it's so nice <laughs> Ordered a few of these pinchos. 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 Hide the little sausage. These are Kenny's other two. You can't hide the little sausage. Well, hide the little sausage. I don't really know what they are. One's falafel, and then this one we don't know. We got this dish just with the goat's cheese on the side. Voila. This is where I was talking about earlier. It's so pretty in here. The inside over there is equally as cool. Guys, we just went to this place. This is hazelnut with like actual hazelnut pieces in and this is chocolate. Honestly, both vegan. I'm real. I'm honestly not joking, best vegan ice cream I've ever had. Look at these roads that we're about to drive down. We've got to the end of the drive now, guys, and it basically you have to park your car and then just walk down and there's kind of a beach here. So we're just gonna take a walk down and have a look. This is the little port area. There's just like a few restaurants and stuff. So pretty here. ridiculous how nice it is here. This is the other side of all of those caves. There's this bit and then just through that gap there where everybody is, that's the water. <laughs> This is the room. We've just got our wardrobes and stuff over here. And in here, you come straight into the bathroom, which has its own balcony, which is really nice. And you can just see over the streets. And then it's kind of a bit more traditional, this hotel, which I quite like. Then we have our bath and then all of our stuff. And if you come through here, we just have our bedroom which is again really nice. And then out here, it's a really nice view for the morning. It's just like all the trees and the rooftops. 
and then this opens out too and it's the same kind of view as from the bathroom but yeah it's actually really cute i really like this i like the way it's a bit more kind of like traditional it's nice just up on the rooftop we're gonna have like our welcome drink up here they just made us a cocktail for when we got here um it's so nice up here but you can kind of see like all over the city and then at the back at the back here you can obviously see the mountains we drove up earlier today so nice and it's just like a little tiny pool but how cool i love like these stripy umbrellas such a vibe they just bought us up our welcome drinks. Kenny had a pina colada. I had something called a Hugo. I don't know if that's like a thing that everybody knows and I just don't know. But it's sparkling wine and elderflower. We've got it all to ourselves up here at the moment. So we're just going to have a bit of a dip, have a bit of a sunbathe and just chill really until it's time to go and have some dinner. If you can see but they're like blowing glitter cannons into the air down there look how beautiful it is here we're literally having the best time we just ordered another cocktail i don't know if you guys can pick that up on the camera there's bits of glitter all in the air i just got the same again and then kenny got an espresso martini and then i just ordered some olives yum <laughs> oops i think we just interrupted like a some kind of a shoot whatever this is <laughs> We're gonna head down and have dinner now. And then we're here till like nine o'clock tomorrow. So we basically have a full day tomorrow. I think we're just gonna chill by the pool, go to Parma, but yeah, I'll keep you posted tomorrow. And yeah, time for some food because this girl seriously needs some food. Kenny has some kind of cod something. And then look at this okay. asparagus, it's still sizzling. It looks so good. Look at the temperature of Kenny's prawns. I cannot. They've been sizzling like this for like five minutes. Vegan patatas parvas. Can you enjoy them, buddy? <laughs> Hi, Kenny. Hello. Morning, guys. So it's our last morning in Palma. That's where we are. It's our last morning in Palma today. We're actually going home tonight, but our flight's not until like nine o'clock this evening. So we're just going to kind of make a full day of it here. Maybe go back, chill by the pool for a bit. Um, and then obviously get a flight later. So we're just on our way to get some breakfast now. Hola. Hola. So as always, Kenny gets his coffee and I've got a green juice. This one's got like banana, orange, loads of stuff in, spinach, ginger. It's actually really good. It's no surprise what I'm having, avocado on toast. And I'm not too sure what this is, but it looks quite nice. Just good. have a toast and tomato. I just thought I'd show you guys down by the port because I don't think I've shown you down here. So pretty. because of what I said to you earlier that everybody says he always looks miserable. <laughs> We've just been chilling by the pool for like a couple of hours or so. Um, and now we're heading to get some food. We really wanted to go back to the place that we went to on the first night called Bar España, but it was closed, which we obviously should have thought of because it's like four o'clock or something. Um, so now we're just heading to this other place. Fingers crossed it's still good. So Kenny's got some kind of cod little thing, so it looks nice. And then have our peppers, and of course platters, blah, blah, blah. And then we're gonna go to another place after this too. We just came to this next place and we've ordered some pita with hummus. We forgot to film these guys, but these are just two left of the little spring rolls we had. They're really good. Mm -hmm. 